Huh? Time to go, man. There we go. That's beautiful. It's basically an aircraft needs for it to be to fly. Yeah. You never forget that. If it's going let somewhere, it, let it fly. Let it fly. You know, yeah. If you ever have any problems with a paraglider, you let it fly, it'll fly away from anything. The boys with the toys are here. <laughs> Man, <laughs> you know, when you're about to jump off, uh, how many feet is this cliff? <laughs> Putting on the helmet and everything. Yeah, it starts to make you wonder. Is this the same? When I say go, I want you to go into just a good powerful lean forward, good powerful walk forward. Okay, okay. Yeah. Now what's going to happen, the weight ring's going to catch, boom, you're going to get pulled back. You know, he told me that we were gonna get dragged backwards just, you know, to lean against it. And I was like, okay, you know, I should be able to do that, right? But that was helpless. You know, the second uh, we started, the, the thing lifted up, it was, I was just full on from my butt, you know, sliding backwards. But he got us up and going pretty easy. Those spirals, man, just, you know, it's so cool. It's like being on a roller coaster ride, just leaning into it, completely sideways, just, you know, it's great. I would love to do both and maybe one day have it be almost one in the same, be almost one in the same, almost one in the same. One in the same. Well, the banshees cry. What's happened up there? And the no, they're coming down with the kite. <laughs> uh, just laying on the back. Is that, can you have been any tangling anywhere? Um, no, no. no. You only have one. Yeah. 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 I thought I'd make it over the ridge, but the, uh, the kite just collapsed on one side and just went into a dive and just ended up sort of falling from two or three metres, I think, just onto my back. A um, little bit of pain when I first landed. Like shitload of pain, and then now I'm, I'm coming right. It's just sort of, it's um, just spasmed up in my lower back, um, but I've got full movement, so there's no worries there. Just and um, get the helicopter ride, so it's quite cool. <laughs> Is that where you got the information for the toy? That's where I got all the information on how to build my own boards. It's where I got all the information on how to put the MP3 player in my car. Yeah? Yeah. Jeez. It allows weird fuckers like me to share information with each other. <laughs> the unedited version of yesterday.
you reckon a kite board can go? I remember once uh, I couldn't touch the water. I was just skimming, mm. and I was I was very fast. Yeah. But I don't know how fast. Yeah. I think 30, 35 knots. I never really think about to do speed with kite surfing. Mm -hmm. yeah, maybe it could be interesting. And then break this place called Joe's. Yeah, I know. I know. And uh, it's better for windsurfing or towing. Mm. Towing is the best. But it happened that I have a friend of mine took me over there with his boat and, uh, you know, I just tried to go, but it's not really, it's not, yeah, it's not meant to be, you know. Yeah. I did something, I was, it's better I stay home and watch TV that day. Yeah. What's your best injury? You mean in the water? Mm. Yeah. yeah. I don't know, because uh, every week I always get something. Yeah? Yeah, some injury. <laughs> I wonder if he's been to jail yet. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go to it some fun, I get yeah. tired of you.
But seriously folks, it's been a great time this week and uh, we'd just like to thank all the people from Red Bull and all the competitors from coming all over the world to make this event superb. What can we say? Thanks mates. Good job. This competition is um, a pilot year for New Zealand. You know, kind of introducing kite surfing and the people that are growing with the sport. I think I'll look back at the video footage and you know the feeling I'm going to get is it was really great to be part of a sport that's growing up. It's going to be really cool years later to look back and laugh. I mean, you know, and just go, yeah, you know, we were just having fun. fun, fun. Just because, like, I'm so-called world champion, I'm not walking around like I'm so cool. You know what I mean? To me, that's not what's real. You know, what's real is you getting out there, doing the sport, and enjoying your life. That's real. I think everything else is just a load of crap.